job. Come here. Sit down. What's the matter? Nothing. Nothing's the matter. There must be something. You're upset. You're not yourself. I tell you, nothing's the matter. John, we've worked, we've starved, we've licked everything together so far. You never held out on me before. What is it, John? Well, what do those guys expect me to do? Climb up and poke my fist through a rain cloud? They look up to you, John. They look up to you for guidance and help. They, they want to believe in you. They picture as their leader. Well, who asked them to pick me? I can make mistakes too, can't I? I'm only human. Can I help it if it, if it don't rain? No one expects you to. But keep your perspective. Be the boss again. Let them think you're not worried. Let them think you know more than they do. Oh, this cheap joint gives me a pain. There's no future here. No place for a guy with big time ideas. Oh, what's the use? I, I've got ideas bigger than this place. Real big stuff. John. This isn't you talking. Somebody else. Some stranger. It's me, all right. I'm finally getting wise to myself, that's all. I'm fed up. I'm sick of the whole place. I'm through with it all. I quit. this thing's gone between you and John. But I do know he hasn't been the same since you came here. And I'm asking you to let him alone. Well, don't blame me. Can I help it if he likes me? For the first time in his life, John's been making good. And, and if you keep this up, you're going to ruin him. You're going to ruin the chances of happiness of all these people. Happiness? Don't make me laugh. Why, this dump will never amount to anything. And as for John, I mean more to him than you and that whole Boy Scout camp put together. Kelly, I told you once you could stay here as long as you want to. Now I tell you to get out. Oh, so you're the boss now, huh? You know you don't belong in a place like this. Get out. All right. I'll go. You will? Will you, Sally? Sure. Sure, I'll go. Oh. Say, it's all right. But John's going with me. John wouldn't go with you. No. John wouldn't go anywhere with you. <laughs> I'm not afraid of that. Can I get you anything? No, it's... it's all right. Oh. 
always doing something, aren't you? Knitting and things like that. You run through a lot of socks, you know. Yeah, I, I guess I do. You see, it can take a lot of looking after. You must get pretty tired of it sometimes. It's my job. Going down to see the men? Well, what's the use? Everything's going all right. You know, you know this camp would certainly be lost without you, John. Yeah. Well, uh, see you later. John, remember the day the Sprouts came home? Sure. Sure, I remember. Why? Wasn't it wonderful? Remember how you felt? Yeah. It was nice. Listen to that. The old powerhouse is working again. You know what that means? How bite what? It means the water's running downstream not two miles from the camp. So what? Well, Chris said irrigation would save the crops. Oh, come on, honey. Let's get going. It's getting late. Chris said if we could get water in four or five days... Forget it, baby. Don't think back. Think ahead. You and me. You're going places. Well, I'll bet in four days we could dig a ditch to carry that water oh, to the you're corn. you're a guy to be digging ditches. You belong with somebody that appreciates you. You belong with me. I'm going back. If you go back, we're through. You'll never see me again. Johnny! working again. There's water in that stream not two miles from here. What we ought to do is get that water down here to our crops. We've got five days to do it in, and I've got an idea of how it ought to be done. It'll mean work. Work without stopping. Yeah, and what'll you be doing? <laughs> I'll be working right along with you. Now, you're going to follow me or quit like yellow dogs? Yeah, you're a fine one to be talking like that. Yeah, you're the guy we have to thank for being in this spot. Forget what you think of me. Think of yourselves. Think of your homes, your wives, your kids. Think of everything you've worked so hard for. Think of losing it because you wouldn't take another chance. Chris, you said irrigation would save the crops. By working day and night, we might be able to dig a ditch and bring that water down here. That'll save our crops, won't it? Men, 
It means everything in the world to you. Come on, let's try it. Chris, how about you? Hey, go get my shovel, Jan. Think it'll work, Chris? Go get your shovel. Okay. If you go, Rock, I'm going to. All right. Yes, and I'm going to. Yeah, and take me with you. And me too. We're not licked. We're going to win. Hello, boy, John. Come on, John. Come on, fellas. Let's go. 